Hey everyone, this is Paul Yeager, back for video number two of this 10-part series. In video one, I covered the two financial objectives that need to be met in this country. Number one, your current lifestyle, and number two, your future lifestyle. But in today's video, I'm going to talk about inflation. Inflation is nothing new in this country because businesses can raise the prices of anything that they want at any time. Your working income, if you make $50,000 a year, but the price of gas goes up, price of food goes up, you know, all, a lot of things, the prices just continue to go up. And if those prices are going up and your income is staying the same or barely increasing, then your income is actually dropping. A um, quick example would be the gas pump. Who remembers when you could put $20 in your gas tank and get a full tank or close to a full tank well now you put twenty dollars in your gas tank and you probably get a quarter of a tank or a half tank so the same amount of money is actually allowing you to buy less of what you need now your future lifestyle should be supported by your investments so that whenever companies increase their prices, inflation will actually boost your income at the same time. But uh, I guess that's the best example I can give on inflation. And inflation is number one of the four biggest problems that we face in this country and in future videos going to show you introduce you to some ways that you can outpace inflation in your favor so that you never have to worry about anything in your future which will be about how to minimize your taxes meaning if you're that person that makes $50,000 a year, $18,000 of that is going right into the government's pocket and I'm going to introduce you to some ways that you can access more of your money. And a lot of people don't know this, but the government and the IRS actually encourage you to do it.